Racism erodes our souls. Um, all of us are impacted. Um, both white people and folks of color and indigenous people are impacted negatively. And so for people of color, those of us who have um, been colonized and those who have been descended from enslaved folks, we're still feeling the trauma of that. The School of Public Health allows me to approach injustice in a very specific way. We're all involved in public health. We're all impacted by what happens in the air, the water, and in healthcare systems. And I wanted to make sure that the people that I know and love um, have access to equitable health care and education and are able to live healthy and full lives. We were able to create the strategic plan for anti-racism, which debuted this summer, 2021. And so we are excited to move forward with that plan and excited to put all of our efforts and resources in a very specific direction. The strategic plan for anti-racism has five sections. We focus on leadership, students, faculty, staff, and alumni. Overall, the vision is for us to identify and dismantle systemic racism at our school. That does include ways that we communicate, how we work with and recruit our students, the education, as well as how we hire, retain, recruit, and develop our employees, and how we interact with the community and the alumni that have finished their degrees here. So we have a lot of work to do in all areas of our school. In the future, I hope that the School of Public Health is a place where everybody can feel welcomed, where everybody can get educated, and where everybody can thrive. I really hope that our students can leave here equipped to work with any community and feel like they are educated and able to combat injustices in our world and particularly in public health. I hope that the kind of work that I do becomes obsolete.